What's going on everybody? This is Uncle Muscles here and I'm going to be redoing my Grand Theft Auto 5 benchmark on the Radeon R9 Fury X uh, post the uh, update. This update just came out on uh, today, July today, and uh, so yeah, so there's a new driver update and I'm going to show you real quickly the settings, setting profile I'm using. I'm using Ultra right now. It ran perfectly without me streaming. So, well not perfectly, it ran a little bit under, uh, uh, it was about 30 FPS average. Some of the heavier parts it ran under 30 FPS, but I was still amazed that it was able to run everything. I'll just show you right now. Everything's on Ultra right now. Or times a MSA times a. Let's make sure this can't go up any further. But I just updated the the uh, the graphics driver, and this is really uh, it's impressive. The driver you still can't overclock on it. I don't think I still have to look into that. Uh, yeah, let's see the softest. Yeah, this is all turned up. Motion blur strength. I don't really want to use that because it's gonna look shitty. Uh, and then okay, so that's all the way up right now. And then we'll just hit the back and go to advanced graphics and just show you everything's turned on. Long shadows, high resolution shadows, high detail streaming while flying. Everything's turned all the way up, and that's what we want. Okay, so let's try the bunch bar test. Hopefully it runs. And uh, guys, don't forget to like it if you like the video, and please subscribe, guys. I really appreciate it. But most importantly, check me out on Twitch, Twitch TV slash Uncle Muscles, guys. I'm streaming games on the already on R9 Fury X all day, every day. So come check me out, guys. Appreciate it. All right, enjoy the video, guys.